again, everybody. Thanks for joining us. I'm Mary Hart. Well, we're quite close. In today's Inside Story, we learn off-camera the Brady Bunch was even closer. Everywhere you looked, love was in bloom. Here's the story of a lovely lady. From 1969 to 74, America watched six squeaky clean kids grow up in the family every kid wanted to be a part of. The Brady Bunch. The Brady Bunch. Now here's the story of an actor named Barry who grew up to write a book. It's called Growing Up Brady by Barry Williams, also known as Greg Brady. He gently tarnishes some of those squeaky clean images, starting with his own, as an extremely hormonal teenager. I was kind of getting excited and turned on by just about anything that moved. Because if there's one thing I know about, it's women. Shocking as it may seem, Barry reveals there was a lot of inter-Brady dating, including the fact that he gave Maureen McCormick, Marsha, her first kiss on location in Hawaii. It was like right out of a romance novel, the... The, the smell of the ocean, the, um, the, the moon was coming up over Diamond Head, and there was that breeze. And I took a chance to do what I'd been wanting to do for probably since we started the series. Back at the studio, their makeout sessions moved to dressing room trailers. <laughs> so we hear this, knock, 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 knock. Hey, what's going on in there? Maureen, you're wanted on the set. You know, oh, yeah, 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 oh, shoot, you know. But, you know, what the heck. According to the book, Eve Plum and Chris Knight, Jan and Peter, were once caught lip-locked by police in the back of a truck. All you boys think about is football. Love is a lot more important. Even the youngest pair of siblings, Cindy and Bobby, played by Susan Olsen and Mike Lookinland, had a special meeting place for kissing. We used to make out in the doghouse, and um, we had a little fake marriage, and we went, walked around for about two weeks hand in hand saying, we're married now, and everybody went, oh, that's cute. And um, then we got divorced. Susan says Mike had a simple reason for wanting the divorce. He kind of lost interest because I wasn't developing fast enough. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Hi, Greg. Perhaps the most poignant chapter in Growing Up Brady is called Dating Your Mom. Barry details his infatuation with on-screen mom, Florence Henderson. I was always attracted to, to her. I, I think if you... Um, if America takes away the apron and uh, forgets about the six kids for a minute and sort of like, like looks at her in that way, you know what I mean. But Florence, who was married at the time, was unaware of Barry's feelings. I didn't know that, that Barry had a crush on me. You know, I thought we were friends and he was, you know, he was the cutest kid. When 15-year-old Barry asked her out, she accepted, not realizing it was an official date. She looked fabulous. And not at all like Carol Brady. Here he was, all hands and feet, and kind of shy and awkward. But the evening did end with a kiss. It wasn't the same kind of romantic kiss that I've come to know later in my, even at later in my teen years. But uh, nonetheless, I, uh, I felt real good about myself. A very sweet little kiss. And that was it. Sorry, folks. <laughs> no mad, passionate sex. I said I wasn't the share of the Brady Bunch set. The bunch of kids truly enjoyed each other's company, even spending their off time together. Barry provided us with some footage from a 1972 vacation they took with on-screen dad, Robert Reed. They traveled to England aboard the QE2. After five years and 117 episodes, the Brady Bunch was canceled. It's had many rebirths and reincarnations, and thanks to its popularity and syndication, it's impacted not just one, but several generations. I believe we were put together to be the kind of a family that everyone would like to have had, and few, if any, people really did. A reunion show of sorts is in the works for the Brady Bunch. Plans call for cast members to get together to watch old episodes and reminisce. On our inside